So how they, hi there. Uh, if you haven't watched my previous video, that's the result after I did the blow dry and when I I put the hair into vacuum rollers and the reason for me doing that is because I want to get nice oil and I want to get nice curls. So if you haven't watched it, go ahead, watch it and see what's the final result. But anyway, this video now is for me doing my makeup. I will go out later on and I have only one hour to get myself ready. So I will I will do my makeup. My makeup is my face is nice white and pink and blue. So my makeup I will come I will do like a smoky eye makeup. So the smoky eye makeup. The first main thing is first you need to clean your face. So you need to clean your face. So after my face is nicely cleaned, I'd like to put my base and the moisturizer. So I'm using a lot of LA Total FX7. So that's going to be my base and at the same time it's going to moisturize my skin and it will protect it from the sun. So after that, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put my primer for, for my eyeshadow. My primer for the eyeshadow, I have the Urban Decay, Urban Decay, I don't know if I pronounce it right. Sorry if I don't. So I'm going to use, I have the two different ones. One of them is shiny, the other one is normal, so I'm going to use. So I'm going to apply on my eyelids. Why I'm doing that is because that will hold my eyeshadow for all night. I won't get all these lines on top of my eyelids because it's horrible when you open and close your eyes and then the eyeshadow breaks so that's why I'm applying the primer on my eyelids if you don't have that primer for the eyeshadow you can just apply foundation or the corrector but if the effect won't be that good as the primer, because I don't show the primer. So after I've done that, I'm going to announce that to dry. So what I'm going to do is, I have the corrector. So I'm going to do that. Remember, I don't like so much makeup, like so heavy makeup. So the makeup I'm doing is quite simple and it's easy and it doesn't take that long time to achieve it's not that much time consuming so that's my corrector i will put that under my eye and a little bit of under the eyebrow okay 
um, the least behaving spot you can avoid on top of them and on top of the eyebrow so the eyebrows can stand out so once I've done that is I will just tap on top of it just to spread it Next, I will apply the eyeshadow and I will do my foundation last. So the eyeshadow, first you always start with the light shade and then you go to the dark one. That's because you don't want to, the brush to get dirty and then clean it and then put the white on again. So, I have a little bit of white, I have a little bit of white, so I'll put that in the beginning of my eye. You see the dot? And after that, I'll apply a little bit under my eyebrow. Okay. After that, I will get the next color, which is after the white one so I'd like to use I'd like to use this one it's nice uh, smoky pink So as you can see, I'm not just doing a line, I'm just tapping into it, into my eyelid. And that's enough with the pink one. Now I'm going to get the next dark color. That's the darkest one. It's like purple, dark purple. And I'm gonna put it in the on the ends of my eyes. So I put I put it in the end of my on my eye and I just want to put a little bit all over the pink just like that just to to the mix of the eye. So after that when I blend it basically it becomes like a smoky effect. There you go, there's the line for the smoky. And now, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to use another brush and I'm going to put some color on top 
of all the colors and underneath the eyebrows. So this color needs to be like lighter. I'm going to use, it's like cream color. So this is the brush I'm using, it's like an angle brush. I will just put that on top. Remember, it doesn't look pretty, but once we mix it, it's going to look really pretty once we blend it. Right now, that's not the final, don't worry about it, it's not the final, final, but that's how it looks before we actually start blending it. Okay, so we need a blending brush, and the blending brush should look something like that. So now what we do is we start from the end of the eye, and we just do a dot, we look up, like that, and we start blending, going go in a circle, like that. And we have to look up while we're doing that. And you can see that the effect is really nice. Okay, so now, after I've done that, I'd like to tap my blending brush into the pink of you. And a light pink, and then I will go over again so I can actually give nice pink color uh, for my smoky eye. So now the top bit to blend it we then go brush then go to one we put the eyeshadow on the eyebrow after I've done that now I will concentrate on the bottom of my eye I will get a little bit of the uh, I already have the, the white eyeshadow, so I'll get the pink one and put a little bit under. And after that, I will get the dark one and do the end bit. And now I will do the mascara. I was going to put eyeliner, but I don't want to worry all night if it's gonna if I'm going to smudge it or not. So I might put later on eyeliner. It will look much better. That's eyelashes I put myself and if you like to see how I'm doing that you can see check out one of my videos for the eyelash extension tutorial I've done. It's nice and easy and I don't have to go every two weeks. Someone to do it for me, I do it myself. So now when I've done the eyeshadow and 
the mascara I will do my foundation I've applied already the correct and the reason I did for the eyeshadow and then I'm doing the foundation is because as you can see there is a little bit of eyeshadow under my eyes so I, I just want to get rid of it so I've done the corrector now I'm doing the foundation I have Fun Effect and this is the palette so this is the foundation I am going to use the brush Yeah. and then after that I will continue with my hand and I blend in so I can blend my forehead so have I And now, when I've done, I've done the foundation, I will do the powder that's gonna stay, that, that will get rid of the shyness of, on, of my face after two hours when the foundation gets dirty because it's normal to get a bit dirty. So the powder. So after I finish with the powder, now I'm going to use a blush. I have collection 2000 blush, which is this color. And I will use this angled brush. And I'm going to do that. Now, after I've done the blush, I'm going to use the highlighter on top of my blush. So it's just to highlight this section like that, and then the other side, and I'll just put a little bit under my eyebrow so I can highlight this and a little bit on top okay and then I will get the brush I've used the blush and blend it nicely and as you can see it's coming out really nice and now I'm going to do my eyebrows so eyebrows I have benefit again and this is the colors I'm going to use I'm going to use the light one of my eyebrows and my hat back I'm going to tap it and I will do the line like that and then underneath the neckline and join them here and then the other one
and I have the blending brush. This is the blending, so I just blend all the colors. And this is my eyebrows. And now, what's left is for the mistake. Mistake. I will use for the pencil. So this is the pencil and I forgot to mention that it's nice for you to put a little bit of foundation on your lips and that makes the lipstick last longer. So Now I will apply the lipstick. And there is one amazing stuff I found in Boots and it's called Clip Coat. That's what it looks like. And I will apply that all over my lips and that's going to seal my lips and like that my my lip So that's going to seal my lip gloss, my lipstick, and like that the lipstick will last me much longer. So just apply that over. And you cannot close your mouth while, while it's getting dry. So you have to keep it open. I will just show you how it looks from closer look. This is the makeup. I'm really happy with the results. I really hope you like it. Hello. So this is the final look. And if you haven't seen my other video of the hair, I, the way I did my hair, please check it out and don't forget to press the like button if you like it. So this is my final look and if you like to see the glow dry and the, how I use the welcome rollers, have a look at my video. But the main thing is that is my makeup, that is the final look of my makeup. There you go, I will get closer. This is the nice lipstick. Um, 
this is the eyeshadow, the smoky eye eyeshadow. And it's really nice. Really nice. And eyebrows. So this is the final look. And if you like to see how I put my eyelash extensions, I got it myself, of course. Of course. And if you like to have a look at that, please check out my other videos. I have over 20 videos now posted. And I will be keep posting. So if you like to subscribe, that would be really nice. And I will keep it posted. Thank you very much for watching. And please like, subscribe, share, comment if you have any opinions. Thank you very much. So now I'm ready to go out. Have a nice day.